Welcome back to 2014 Central Europe Throwdown. We are here at CrossFit Bratislava to announce workout number two. The qualifier workout number two consists of two separate scored events. Event number one is three rounds for time, 10 snatches at 50 kg for men and 35 kg for women, 15 chest to bar pull ups for men and pull ups for women, and then 20 double unders for both men and women. Score is total time, or if uncompleted, the score is total reps completed in 12 minutes. Then, in the remaining time, complete as many rounds and reps as possible of three clean and jerks, 80 kilos for men, 50 kilos for women, and three muscle ups for men and one muscle up for women. The standards for the snatch are the bar starts on the ground. Athlete has to bring the bar overhead in one smooth motion. You can choose to do muscle snatch, power snatch, squat snatch or split snatch. If you choose to do split snatch, you have to bring your feet back together to finish the repetition. No rep will be given if control of the bar overhead is not shown, elbows, shoulders and hips are not fully locked in one straight line, the athlete bounces the bar on the ground, or the bar does not touch the ground after each repetition. The standard for the chest to bar pull up are strict keeping or butterfly pull ups are allowed as long as the requirements are met. The arm must be fully extended at the bottom position. At the top, the chest must clearly come into contact with the bar. No rep will be given if the arms are not fully extended at the bottom position and when the chest is not touching the bar. When doing chin over the bar pull ups for women, the standards are the same, except the athlete has to bring his chin over horizontal plane of the bar. Touching the bar with the chest is not required. The standards for double unders are The rope has to pass twice on the athlete's feet with every jump. Be careful with the counting repetitions. Only successful jumps count, not attempts. The standards for a clean and jerk are The bar starts on the ground and ends when the bar is under control with elbows, shoulders, hips and knees in straight line. The athlete has to clean the bar first to his shoulders and then get it overhead. Clean can be done as muscle clean, power clean, squat clean or split clean. After successfully cleaning the bar, it can be brought overhead by using press, push press, push jerk or split jerk. If the athlete chooses to do a split jerk, he has to bring his feet back together to finish the repetition. No rep will be called if the athlete gets the bar overhead by snatching it instead of doing a clean jerk. The athlete doesn't show full control at the end of the repetition. The bar doesn't touch the ground between reps. The athlete bounces the bar on the ground. In the muscle up, you must begin with or pass through a hang below the rings with arms fully extended with or without the false grip and the feet off the ground. Finishing in support with fully extended arms is required. No reps are given if the athlete doesn't fully extend the arms in the bottom or upper position. 